Hey guys, what is up? I am back with another video. Today, I'm going to be showing you guys how to download any version of any app from the App Store. Whether it's new or old, it'll work. But before we get into the video, make sure to hit the like button and subscribe to my channel because I make tons of content just like this that you definitely don't want to miss. Let's get into the video. So guys, the first thing you're going to need to do is go ahead and get jailbroken. If you're not already jailbroken, don't worry, I'll leave links in the description where you can get a jailbreak. I have a link for iOS 9 all the way up to iOS 14, so you're covered. So guys, once you're jailbroken, you're either going to have Cydia or Celio, so I'm going to show you how to do it on both. So guys, I'm going to start off with Cydia, and then we'll do Celio right after. And guys, this does work on the newest iOS 14, as well as several other versions. So let's head into Cydia now. So here we are in Cydia, and we're going to go ahead and go over to Sources, hit Edit, and then add and add this repo. So once you have this repo, go ahead and click add source. It's going to give you a warning, could be in any different language, but go ahead and click add anyway. When it's done, go ahead and click return to Cydia. Go over here to the search down at the bottom and let's go ahead and type in app store plus plus. And you guys are going to see there's going to be two options here. So you can click on one of them and you'll see this one's by Sarah H numbers and stuff. So go ahead and go back. The one that you want to get is the one that has Coke pokes as the developer. So once you've got this one, click modify and go ahead and, and install it. Since I already have it, it's going to tell me to reinstall. So I'll go ahead and do that now. Go ahead and click confirm and it'll download. Now guys, once it's done downloading, you can go ahead and click restart springboard. So we're back into iOS now after restarting a springboard. So let's go ahead and go back into Cydia. Now once you're in Cydia, go ahead over to installed and make sure you have this right here. If App Store Plus Plus doesn't install, just redo everything you just did and reinstall App Store Plus Plus. If you don't see it here, go ahead and redo it. This will work almost every single time, but every once in a while there can be a little issue that causes it to not install. So if you need to, reinstall it. But if you see it here, you're good to go. So once you're done, go ahead and click home. And let's go ahead and go into the App Store. So I'm in the App Store here. If you've never used this before, it might come up with some pop-ups. Just go ahead and proceed and accept everything that it tells you to do so that we can use this properly. And now I'll just go ahead and show you some examples of how this works. So here's YouTube and I can just go ahead and click onto it. And so how you use this is you actually want to hold on to the cloud or get button. This does not affect if you haven't had it before. You can do this even if you haven't and I'll show that in just a minute. You're just going to hold on to either the cloud button or the get button. So go ahead and hold on to it. And this list will come up and you can go ahead and click upgrade or downgrade. And then you can select whichever version you want. Since every version of the YouTube app for iPhone sucks after 15.20, I'm going to pick 15.19. So you can see it finally starts loading and you see the bar here. So I can go ahead and go to the home screen. You can see my YouTube installing here and it is now done. So I'll just show you that this is the older version and then I'll show you how to get different apps. So I'll go ahead and show you real quick that this is the older version. Let's go into YouTube. So here I am in YouTube. I'm going to go ahead and type out my YouTube channel. So I'm going to go ahead and go on one of my newer videos. And you can see the old like system is here, as well as the old description boxes, as well as the old like system carried over into the comments. Another thing is that you can see the bar here is different. Everything is just different here. So you know this is the older version. Now I'll show you that it's the same for apps you don't already own. So let's head back into the App Store. Looking for an app I haven't already owned yet. Pac-Man's our lucky winner. So you can see I have not owned this app yet. I can go ahead and hold onto the get icon and the list comes up here too. I can go ahead and click upgrade slash downgrade and pick from any version I want. So I'll go ahead and pick like, I don't really know how this app's history has gone. So I'm just gonna pick like 9.2.4, like whatever. So I'll go to the home screen. Wow, that downloaded really fast. By the time I got to the home screen, it was already done. But I don't really know the differences between the new Pac-Man app and the old one. So I'll go ahead and go to the settings and show you that is the exact version number that I downloaded. So here you can see YouTube is the exact one I downloaded, 5.19. And same with Pac-Man, 9.2.4, the exact version that I downloaded. Now I'll move over to Cilio and show you how to do it on that. So guys, I'm on an iPhone 6 Plus now, and this jailbreak method has Cilio instead of Cydia. So I'll go ahead and show you how to do that now. And it's going to work basically the same as Cydia, it just looks a little different. So I'll show you how to do that. So let's head into Cilio. And here in Cilio, we're going to go over to sources down here. So once again, here, we're going to go ahead and click plus. So once again, we're going to add repo.hackyouriphone.org. And then once you've got that, go ahead and click add source again. 
When you add the repo, you might see this screen. You can go ahead and ignore it because this does not have any problems. So once you've got repo.hackyouriphone.org downloaded, you can go to search. You can go and search App Store Plus Plus. And Cilio is actually pretty nice because it tells you which developer right here without you needing to go right into it. So like I said, when we were doing the Cydia one, we're going for the developer Coke Pokes. So we'll go ahead and do that. So you're gonna wanna go ahead and click get. And it's gonna move it to the queue down here. Just click the queue and click confirm. And we can go ahead and once again, click restart springboard. The springboard has now been restarted. We can go ahead and click home and go into the app store and set it up. So once again, you may get some prompts to go ahead and accept. So go ahead and do that so we can go ahead and do this. So I'm gonna head over to search now. So here's the YouTube app again, and this is basically gonna be the same as it was on Cydia. It is the same as it was on Cydia, but now I have the prompts for whatever reason. I don't know why I didn't have them before, but I'll go ahead and dismiss that. And like I said before, you can just hold on to the app and click upgrade slash downgrade. And this time I'm gonna go back a little further. So let's go back to like, just 15.2. It's gonna go ahead and install now. You can see it now downloading. So here's my YouTube app and it will go ahead and download. And my YouTube app is now installed and I'll go ahead and show you that it's the old version. And you can see it is still the old version. So I'll go ahead and click home. And here in settings, you can once again see that it's the same version I downloaded, 15.2. So guys, that is how you can install any version of any app on the App Store. If you like this video, please hit the like button because it'd help me out a ton. And don't forget to hit the subscribe button. Because like I said in the beginning, I make tons of content just like this that you definitely don't want to miss. I'll see you in the next one.